Hey, I'm Joe with Inch Calculator, and today we're going to talk about how to convert pounds to ounces and ounces to pounds. We'll also go over how to convert ounces into a mixed pounds and ounces measurement, and I'll show you a really cool tool to make all this much easier. So let's get started. Pounds and ounces are both U.S. customary and imperial units of measure, and we use them quite often for measuring weight in the United States. Pounds are usually denoted with the letters LB, or LBS when there's more than one, and ounces are usually denoted with the letters OZ. Before we dive into how to convert pounds to ounces though, we need to cover some fundamentals. The most important thing to keep in mind is that there are 16 ounces in one pound. We call this the conversion factor, or the rate of ounces per pound. To convert pounds into ounces, we multiply the measurement in pounds by 16, since there are 16 ounces in a pound. To convert ounces back to pounds, we divide that measurement by 16. So, to go from pounds to ounces, we multiply by 16, and to go from ounces to pounds, we divide. Let's go through some examples to see how this works. Let's look at how to convert 5 pounds into ounces. To get the answer, multiply the weight in pounds by 16. So 5 pounds times 16 is equal to 80 ounces. Let's try one more example and convert 2.5 pounds into ounces. Just like before, multiply the pound measurement by 16. 2.5 pounds times 16 is equal to 40. So 2.5 pounds is equal to 40 ounces. It's totally fine to use a calculator for some of these conversions, so feel free to grab one if you need to. If you have any questions as we go through this, please ask them in the comments below, since someone else is probably wondering the same thing. And if this video has been helpful so far, we'd really appreciate it if you gave us a like. It really helps us out. Now let's talk about how to convert ounces into pounds. To convert ounces to pounds, we simply divide the ounces by 16 instead of multiplying. Let's try an example and convert 60 ounces into pounds. Start by dividing 60 by 16, which is equal to 3.75. So 60 ounces is equal to 3.75 pounds. Let's try another example and convert 72 ounces into pounds. Like before, let's divide 72 ounces by 16, which is equal to 4.5 pounds. In cases like this, though, you'll sometimes want to express partial pounds as a mixed measurement of pounds and ounces. So 72 ounces would be equal to 4 pounds and some extra ounces left over. To get a mixed measurement like this, you can actually use long division. <laughs> I know what you're thinking when I mention long division, but it's not too challenging here. And if you need to, we actually have a long division calculator that can help you solve this. Check the description for a link to that. Okay, so how many times does 16 go evenly into 72? The answer is 4 times. So multiply 4 times 16, which is 64. Then 72 minus the 64 leaves us with 8 remaining. So the result is 4 pounds and 8 ounces. 72 ounces is equal to 4.5 pounds, which is the same thing as 4 pounds, 8 ounces. And of course, you can always use our pounds to ounces conversion calculator to convert pounds to ounces or vice versa. I'll add a link to that along with some other useful resources in the description below. Feel free to check it out if you're interested. And that's it. That's how we convert pounds to ounces and ounces to pounds. We hope this helped you understand a little bit more about converting units of weight. And if it did, don't forget to like the video. Thanks a lot, and we'll catch you on the next one.